and drawing the defense towards him, the kick out play, wide open shot for Arvin Santos, but this game is not over, it's far from over, San Miguel may be prematurely celebrating. And let's see what Vivek has in store for us when we return. A minute and five remaining, that's a, a timeout story. Here's Bimeg with a crucial possession. Tony Washam. No, and rebound goes to Arwin Santos. And the big play there was San Miguel did not foul Tony Washam as he went straight to the hole. Washam trying to be aggressive, trying to pick up the foul. And now Bimeg. Oh, was that a tech? Timeout. A timeout. Timeout has been called. Not a foul was given up. Timeout. And yeah, we'll take a short break. We'll be back. Don't go away. All right, back inside the big dome. 47 seconds remaining. 10 seconds from the shot clock of the Beerman. Here's Kabagnot. Kabagnot attacks. Kabagnot with a floater. No. Freeman for the putback. An offensive foul is called on Alex Kabagnot. <laughs> And if you're San Miguel, that's something you don't want to happen. A turnover situation, offensive follow from your point guard. And you would want your point guard to stabilize your team, especially with that much time left in the game. And now, BMA third base calls their last time out. Possible tying basket in their hands. We'll uh, pause for these few messages, be back in a few. All right, we're going to set all screens for We're going to set all screens for KG. All right, KG goes to the corner. All right, Tony, you do your screen. After you set the screen, you're going to get the ball right here. All right, step out. What's on the ball? All right, step out. Now I want you to go right. I want you to go right. You go behind him, you go behind him. If you are in trouble, they will sag off the man of KG. KG will be open here. Same will be open here. All right, again. So do you want me to take a shot or whatever? Uh, you can take a shot. It's really up to you. If you're open, take it. All right? All done. Swing. Don't be ready to take that shot. All right, penetrate. Hey, and one. Go, go, go. go. Well, in that huddle, Coach Ryan, well, in this lineup, it's all shooters. We have uh, James Yap, Donald Yado, Tony Washam, and KG Canaletta, and even Roger Yap can uh, nail a three. Well, they're, they're looking at the best possible opportunity, but they want the ha ball in the hands of Tony Washam, who's their go-to guy. But I don't think Coach uh, Ryan Gregorio is looking for an outright three-point shot. They want to make sure that they get the quick two points, but if there's a three-point shot that's open, they'll go for it. Oh, but a steal here Off the end by the Beerman. A big one. Oh, and almost an all counter steal. Gave Freeman. And they hold on to the leather. This time, Ontiveros goes. And there's a foul. <laughs> Alex Kapagnot with the presence of mind of killing the clock, wasting away some precious seconds he could have gone to the he could have gone for the basket immediately you know, for a while there they weren't decided if they would take a shot or kill the time because had they taken a shot it would have been two possessions and uh with such uh, so much time remaining well, let's see bmeg does not have any more timeouts and Duncan Antiveros yeah, has now a... missed five free throws in this game. The door is still open here for Bimek Derby Ace. But a basket here will make this a two-possession game. So it's important that he makes this free throw. A very, very big free throw coming up here for Antiveros. He's got to make this one. And he does. That puts a lot of pressure now on Bimek because it's a two-possession game. Here's Timberlake. Timberlake now racing uh, to the front court. Timberlake, oh! Probably a bit well advised. And Arwin Santos couldn't handle the leather. So it will go back to Bimek. 8.9 seconds remaining. Problem is, we'll have a timeout dito on Bimek Derby Ace. Here's Washam. All they have to do is delay him. Here's an outside shot and doesn't even draw iron. 
San Miguel is going to hold on for this big come from behind victory. And so, Benito, this time down, it is a big comeback for the San Miguel Beermen from 17 points down, a reversal of what happened in game number two when it was the Beermen Derby Semados coming back from 18 points down to snatch that win. And right now, an advantage, a two to one advantage in this best of seven semifinal series for the San Miguel Beermen. And right now, Magu Marjon is with our best player of the game. And Richard, that is none other than Don Don Ontiveros. Don, natapang ka kayo ng hanggang 17 puntos. Import nyo in and out of the game because of foul trouble. Tapos low scoring pa yung final score. The odds were stacked against you. Saan kayo kumuha ng lakas for this victory? Saan kami kumuha ng lakas? Well, right and at the, ano, at the half time, Daniel was like mad. Galit siya. Sabi na play with heart. Pero we showed it the second half. And guys, step up. Welcome to some marginal free throw, Mono. Arwin Santos, how about that shot? First five three-point attempts niya, Mintis. Pero cold-blooded yung mula. Talk about that. Well, that's that's Arwin. Yeah, he's confident every time. Magbimiss man yung tensions, pero he's gonna shoot it if he's open. Pero good thing, we made it. And yeah, we can say we can play a close game versus BMEC. Because sinasabi nila, BMEC, pag close game, they, they always win. Pero yun, napakita namin na we can play a um, close game. Big game for Don Don, 16 points. Imbitahan mo yung supporters niyo for game number four. Uh, mga fans at San Miguel, hopefully you'll always be there for us. Game four, uh, we'll, we'll go hard. And yun, hi sa anak ko, hi kay Denok. Yan nagsabi na ako best player ngayon before the game. So, yun, good motivation. Hi sa mga uh, family ko sa Cebu. MPG, hi. Congratulations once again, Don, and congratulations to San Miguel. Let's go back to Coach Richard and the Dean. All right, pwede pala mag ibang hula si Deno. Oo, siya pala nag-hula. Magiging best player si Don Don. Oo, hard fourth win here for San Miguel, Kinito. I thought they played excellent defense down the stretch, particularly on Tony Washam. Don Don and Tiveros had a share of defensive moments against Washam. Ganon din si Arwin Santos. Tapos, pag hindi na umubre, hindi na one-on-one defense yung double team nila against Washam. And Washam... Ending up with only 22 points, that's a far cry from 33 in game two. All right, so that's the final score, 74 to 70. San Miguel winning up two games to one here in their best of seven series. Up next, the game number three of the best of seven semifinal series between Talk and Tech and Alaska. In behalf of Patricia Bermuda, season Magu March on my partner, Peter Henson. I'm Richard Del Rosario. Thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for the next game.